Welcome to my YouTube channel once again. This is Oscar Nzinti Football, where we discuss anything to do with football from Africa to the world and from the world to Africa. Orlando Pirates have progressed to the last eight of the Beer Cup, the Carling Black Label Knockout. They've dismissed uh, Cape Town Spurs, who are really struggling. The guys are yet to win any match this season. No disrespect to Cape Town Spurs, but uh, I don't think they need any other competition in their hands. They really need to focus on survival. Their priority and main objective should be to stay in the PSL. And they really need some experience, new players to really change how things are looking at the moment. Well, the purpose and reason uh, for this uh, episode is really to focus on the main point that was spoken about when this uh, competition was launched and uh, I'm talking about the Man of the Match award that it was going to be uh, voted by the viewers and fans and um, I don't know, I don't know, maybe you'll tell me obviously football is a game of opinion and even this platform on YouTube, it, uh, it's my opinion I'm not saying uh, I'm the final word, I'm uh, with the final authority, I'm just giving my opinion and uh, it would be interesting also to hear uh, your opinion on this matter. They voted Timbukos to Lodge as the man of the match for the game and uh, I am not sure about that because according to me he was really not the standout performer in the match. Did he have a decent game? Yes, definitely. He played out so i'm not sure if the fans are really voting for the guy because of what of what's happening in his personal life or not but anyway it's also good to see temigoti launch uh vincent pule olisanda back in the field we need these players uh back in the field we need to see these top professionals uh doing what they love most uh, obviously injuries um, were the reason they were not part of uh, the squad uh, in the past months but to see them back in the field is, is really uh, wonderful but again going back to the topic was Timbukosi Lodge the standout performer yesterday I don't think so I think Oli Sandar for me deserved that man of the match award but again it goes back to what Tim Sugazi said uh, when the competition was launched uh, that uh, we will probably have uh, players who were not standout performers winning this uh, this award. Fortunately, in this case, the player is playing for Orlando Pirates. It would have been something else if the player uh, that wins the award was coming from Cape Town Spurs. But we are going to really have uh, multiple cases where the most deserving player is not going to take away that 100,000 rand that everyone probably wants. Yeah, if you're seeing my face, for the first time please do hit that like button and uh, let me hear your, your opinion uh, was Lodge the standout uh, performer in that game let me see your comments in the comment section below if you've not subscribed to this channel please do subscribe like follow share my content to all social platforms I really really appreciate to my viewers who are coming back uh, I really appreciate the support. I really try and uh, give uh, to reply to all the comments uh, in all the videos. Uh, obviously, it's not going to be at the perfect time when you comment, uh, but I always try and attempt to really reply to all your comments. As I've said before, it's my opinion, and yes, a wise man once said, I am a man born under sin, subject to correction. So yes, I'm not the final authority who was your man of the match. And uh, going forward, do you think that maybe Black Label maybe should just take this back to the analysts who were voting for the standard performer on all these matches? Because it's quite unfair. I mean, 100,000 rands is a lot of money. 100,000 rands being deposited into Oli Sanders' account, that's a, that's a whole lot of money. Um, Bunjan won it uh, against Sundowns. Lodge is up. So there's about three matches today. It's cheaper. 
it's um Eros, uh, it's cheaper it's amazulu and i don't know the last game i'm hoping that the viewers will vote for the most deserving player i mean when when it comes to voting for the man of the match uh one should take away um uh, alliance and affiliation with the club and uh, your love for a certain player uh should not uh, uh you know should not come between you uh you voting for the most deserving player on uh, on the day but anyway i think i've spoken a lot about uh, what i needed to say on this video and uh, thank you for staying this long with me this was oscar city football and uh, please don't forget to subscribe thank you so much and god bless